Hey Prometheans, thanks for checking out my channel. Today we're going to cover a lead code problem. The problem is called reverse string and we're going to solve it in JavaScript. So let's read through the problem. I will talk about a solution and then we will do the code. So let's read what it states. It says, write a function that reverses a string. The input string is given as an array of characters S. So what they want to, us to do is take the string of characters H-E-L-L-O and return the reverse of that O-L-L-E-H. And also note that they have said, do not allocate extra space for another array. So they want us to change the existing array. So let's talk about how we solve this. So we have the string S, string is H-E-L-L-O. What we're gonna have to do is two pointers. One, I'm gonna call the first, and then the other one, I'm gonna call the last. And we're gonna to have to swap these, but before we can swap them, we need to store this first one in a temp because we're gonna overwrite that. So I will create a variable called temp, and then I'll put the first letter in there, H. Then what we'll do is we'll take O and we will replace H. So we would get O, E, L, L, O. So the way that we would do that, do that would be first equal to the last. And then next what we want to do is we want to take this H character and we want to replace it here because we stored it in a temp. So the way that we would do that is take last equal to temp. So then our string would become O E L L H. All right, so we've swapped the first and the last. So then what we want to do is increase this by one and decrease this by one. So that now this becomes our first and this becomes our last. And so we go through the loop again. Okay, next we have the character E that we want to store in temp. And then we're going to swap the L with the E. So that would be O L L L H. Then we want to take the E character and we want to swap it with the L. So then our string would be O L L E H. And then we want to decrement again. So we would go to this one uh, plus one and then this one minus one and we've landed right there in the middle. So there's no, no more characters to swap so we can go ahead and exit the loop. And this is our final string, which is the opposite of hello, H-E-L-L-O. And that's what we should get in our result. So that's how you solve it. Let's do the code and I'll show you how it looks. So first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna do two variables, one for the first and one for the last of the string. So let first equal zero, that's the start of the string, and then let last equal s dot length minus one, and that will be the last character of the string. Now we're going to do a while loop, and what we're going to ask is if the first is less than or equal to the last, and that way as they go in, you'll keep going until they equal each other, and that reaches the midpoint and then you'll break out and you've done your swapping. So then what that looks like is while first is less than equal to last. And then what we're going to do is set our temp directory. So let temp equal to s first. And then the next step is we're going to swap the first and the last. So s first is going to be equal to s at last. And then now we're going to take that character in the temp and put it into the last. So that would be s last would equal temp. Then what we need to do is increase the first so we would do that by first plus plus and then decrease the last we'll do that by last minus minus 
and then we can go ahead and return our string. All right, let's go ahead and run it. All right, I hope that helps and I look forward to making more of these videos. So if you have any comments, please leave those below and I'll see you in the next video. So long.